still keeping the secrets here, but if you can let us know what kinds of things that you most look forward to as, as, um, as actors and as fans. In the show. In the show. Right, who, who hasn't seen it? Me. Oh, that's a big... <laughs> Okay, there's a lovely little moment which it comes um, towards the end of the first act. And then it's all in four acts, two parts, part one, part two, with the left. And it's a little change that happens for Ron, Harry, and Hermione. And if those who know it, know it. And we, well, I take great pleasure in that moment and it terrifies me every time, is all I'm going to say. That was really unhelpful, I know. Anybody else? Then there's, we, we start on King's Cross Station. We, we can say that, can't we? It's, yeah, been, it's great. been in the trailers. So um, it's, a, it's a little moment for us all to be together right at the very beginning of the Except show. Except for me, I'm not the best And me. Yeah, yeah. Apart from the male boys. Yeah. Um, but um, the first time we, we performed this in America, um, we did our little scene at the beginning and I walked off and just said to her, I love Broadway. <laughs> no, you didn't. You said, I bloody love Broadway. What was it? Was it the reaction? Was it the feeling? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Lots of clapping. Big fan of clapping. <laughs> I love clapping. Love laughing. It's great. It's really fun. helpful when you're, you're playing someone who's really miserable and you know, <laughs> quite, quite half of the play is going through sort of all sorts of traumatic backstory. It's loud. <laughs> loud compared with London. Everything's louder. The gasps, the, 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 the roar of the grease paint, the smell of the crowd, everything is just turned up to 11 over here. It's fantastic. Absolutely true. I think there's something consistent though, which is the quality of a Harry Potter fan. Which is <clears throat> loyal, intense, intelligent, and very attentive. Would you agree? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yeah. In London, um, going through seeing one another every single day, I met up with him like a month after, and I haven't seen him for a month, and it was like running into an ex. <laughs> I, I, I was like, hey, you look great. <laughs> he was like, have you been? You know, it's like, it was really weird. We had to have like three pints before we could just like settle down again. Yeah, it was, like, it was really weird. Yeah. Um, I would definitely miss, I'll miss everyone. Yeah, I think I'm going to miss playing someone really good. <laughs> I don't often play people this good. And, uh, or not good, you know what I mean. Like, uh, I don't know, decent, true, honest, all that. And um, it's quite interesting. It's really juicy to play people who aren't that. But it's, it's made me feel a bit better about myself for the last few years. So. <laughs> I'm going to have to do that for myself now. Now, I'm really going to miss New York. And I don't, I don't think we even comprehend what it's going to be like not... Uh, embodying these characters um, anymore. I think it's going to be a big, big transition for us. And other people will be doing it all over the world and are doing it already. So it's also sort of light and meaningless. Like the baton's already passed and the story continues. Stop it. <laughs> well, um, before we go to your audience questions, we have a little treat.